Christmas trees have definitely been associated with the emergence of symptoms in allergic people. Uh-oh. My beautiful tree? The source of my newly developed allergy? It's possible, but not because you're allergic to the pine or spruce needles. Most of the time, these Christmas trees uh, have been contaminated with molds or even pollens. Both of those are probably more of a problem with mold being the main one. Also, people tend to store trees before they're sold in moist areas. This can also lead to the emergence of molds on the trees as well. So if that's the case, you would think an artificial tree could help you out, but they could also be a source of mold and dust allergies. People store them in damp areas, and there's no question that over the course of the year, even a fake tree can become uh, contaminated with these different allergens. This does not mean Christmas is canceled. There are ways to ensure your allergies are kept under control. The tree doesn't have to make you sneeze. Try and get that tree washed before bringing it into the house. Hose it down, shake it very well, try and get some of those uh, dust particles, molds, or whatever else is contaminating your tree off your tree before bringing it into the house. And if you do want a real tree and all of these measures are not sufficient, then medicate yourself appropriately. We now have excellent treatments for both allergic rhinitis and asthma. Use them liberally, especially around the holidays if you need them, if you do have a real tree allergy. Eggnog and allergy pills? Sure as long as it keeps the holiday spirit going. <laughs>